BBC Radio York. Be part of it. it. So there was a wee taster of how our session guests tonight, Stolen Earth, sound like when they've been at it in the studio. Now tonight they're going to play a stripped back version of a couple of their tracks for us. And they're going to kick off with a track called Soul in a Jar.
Radio York. Be part of it. That was Stolen Earth with Soul in a Jar, and here's their second session track tonight, Perfect Wave.
Awesome, 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 awesome. Stolen Earth, thank you so much for coming into the BBC Introducing Studios. Thanks for having us. Do you want to just introduce yourselves? Yes, I'm Heidi, Heidi Widdup, and I'm the vocalist and um, acoustic twiddler, and I twiddle on things you blow into. Like that flute we just heard. Yes. Brilliant. Uh, I'm Paul, I play bass and a bit of backing vocal. Adam Dawson, uh, guitarist, backing vocal, and tonight a little bit of piano as well. Now, of course, we've got to tell the, you this isn't the full clan, is it? By no. any nope. any means, who's missing, Heidi? Uh, oh, <laughs> Barry, Big our bears. lovely drummer, and John, our lovely keyboard man. Okay, and how was it playing for uh, us acoustic? Because it's not really your sort of style, is it, Paul? No, it's the first time we've ever done it. Actually, we had a rehearsal about three weeks ago. Ran through a couple of songs, and then, and here we are. And how did it? How do you feel it sounded to you, Adam? Well, from where we were, it sounded great. It was, it was quite, <laughs> it, it was quite intimate. I thought it was, it was pretty, uh, pretty cosy sounding. Yeah, no, I thought it sounded fab. So thank you so much for <laughs> bringing and, and changing your style, basically, to come and suit us. So thank you so much. So let's get on, cracking on and talking about uh, the music. How long have you guys been uh, recording together, Heidi? Um, not very long. Um, we formed the band about 10 months ago, uh, or 11 months ago, and we've done a few gigs and we're in the process of recording our first album. So it's new, very new. And it's all gone pretty quickly, I guess, from uh, January to like sort of doing your first album. And yep. how are you sort of getting the sound together? Well, I mean, we like we say, we started in January, and the first gig was in August. So we spent that time writing the songs, um, and the, the the sound has kind of developed itself, really, because we all come from so many different musical backgrounds. Um, like Heidi will tell me about this great band that she's you know she's been into all her life, and I've never heard of them, which is, is re works really well when we're writing songs together because we get the different influences in there, and everything sounds new and different. So. It's now I asked you off Mike, how long does it take to put together a piece? Because I mean, uh, on like your website and Facebook, it's, it describes yourself as atmospheric rock and there seems to be so much texture and so much layers to yeah. your sound. I mean, when we heard uh, Tuscany Sun earlier, how long does it take to craft a, a song? Well, it's, uh, I mean, the whole process, we're talking about rehearsals, we can be, we can be working on a song for, for, for three or four weeks before we actually even know what parts we're playing. Yeah. So, it, you know, it can take a while. And then when it comes to recording it, that takes just as long, you know. But considering you've only been playing together and got together since January, which is the start of the year, which seems hardly any time at all, I saw that you guys think you have enough material for not just one album's worth, three mm. albums worth. I mean, yeah. is there just stuff pumping out all the time, Heidi? Yes. Um, I think because us three that are here now, we are all, we're very creative and we write our own material it's just part of who we are i don't think we can help it you know if we didn't do it i think <laughs> we just wouldn't function would we <laughs> and um, so we haven't heard everybody's stuff yet and people just keep throwing things into the mix but there's no uh, there's certainly not going to be a shortage of material fantastic and is it a case of just getting everybody in the studio and recording as much as possible and then run up to christmas well, that's it, yeah. We're kind of we're <coughs> doing it on alternate weekends, really. Yeah. Yeah, we're just throwing people into the studio as and when they've got a spare couple of hours. Yep, yeah. so hopefully the album will be out in May. Okay, and where can people check out your stuff? You guys have your own website as well, haven't you? That's Yeah, that's probably the best place to look, actually. That's kind of the hub of, of everything. Everything's kind of launched from there. So, so stillenearth.com is the place to have a look, and then you can sign up to the newsletter and get freebies and, and get kept in the know and gig dates and all the rest of it. And of course, YouTube. Lots of snippets and yeah, clips yes. and things on YouTube. Still on Earth, thank you so much for thank being you. here thank with you. BBC Introducing. Thanks, I wish you all the best with the album and the upcoming tour. Thank, thank you, you very much. Cheers. Thank Cheers. you. BBC Radio York.